Hello YouTube, this is Glennis from Craft Room Secrets and I wanted to share with you guys my Mother's Day gift which was a second IKEA Rascal card and my daughters gave me this uh, because uh, they said I have too much stuff <laughs> so I decided to use my second Rascal for my uh, planner supplies and I did have them in a DIY box and I love my box but it was already overflown so I'm, I do have a lot of those, you know, post-it notes. So I was looking for ideas how to store them. And let me show you first like a little overview of the card. And what I did in the front, I just attached this uh, file of facts. Uh, this was like the clear packaging that came in with, the, uh, with one of my planners. And I just put it there to make the card different from the other one that I have. Um, what I use, and let me show you, this might be a good idea. These clear containers are from uh, Dollar Tree, and they came from three for a dollar, and they're like, um, to put makeup and stuff like that, I have this in my makeup uh, vanity, but I use them because they have the perfect size, let me show you, uh, for uh, post-it notes. They, are, they fit perfectly, and you have room to move through them and um of course i or uh, let me show you how i organize it so i put in here the current collections these are in here are kind of these sides that are like uh, a little bit taller and then these ones will be the ones that are kind of more square you can see how many i can fit in each of those containers uh by the way you can put uh, four uh, those containers come in three sizes small uh medium and large and then you have you can fit four of the medium um Two of them, no, I'm sorry, four of the small, two of the medium side, side by side, one large and one small um, in each of the level. Of course, you can do different combinations, uh, whatever you like or whatever you feel that you should, you know, organize. And um, in this one, I have uh, this target stamper and some stamps that I use, uh, like this one that says, do not forget. This is the one that we got in Target also. Um, in here, in this one, I put all the, you know, the page flags and little flags and um, smaller items. In this one, you have the posters that are like, you know, this uh, size. In this ones are the plain color. Uh, I also have the uh, infamous uh, light bulb. I think this is the one that started my addiction the first time I got that one. <laughs> in this one, I organize all the um, holidays ones. And you can see I even got the, uh, this weekend I found the 4th of July ones. And then in here, in the back, I um, put the bigger ones, the bigger sizes. And you can see how many I can put in the back. Um, this here, um, I think I got it in Prima, uh, from Prima in a packaging. So I just put it there. I think it's pretty. And then for my pens, I was going to do uh, two of these containers, but they are a little bit low. So what I did is I used, uh, you know, this, I have this plain white paper cups. And two of them fit in the back uh, just to organize my pens and pencils. Um, this little guy, I came in in an eBay package that I purchased, and I just have it there for fun. So this was the first floor, and in the first floor, I had all my sticky notes and post-it notes and pens. And then in the second floor here, I have, like, my stamping. Uh, my Studio, studio L2E stamp, um, another stamp from Prima that I use for planning. And then um, you can see the medium sized containers. Uh, I put them like this so I can put larger items. Like these boxes uh, fit perfectly in them. Um, I have supplies like pencil, eraser, um, scissor. Also in this one I have more ink and stamps. In this one I had all my page flags and um, my Martha Stewart tabs. And in these ones, I have my sticky notes, the ones that are bigger sizes that didn't fit in the top. Um, that um, I put them, you know, horizontally. Also, those that come in like in, you know, like in those metal containers. And in the back, I have my uh, little notebooks. Also, like um, refill paper, refill color paper for my file of facts and inserts. And my, uh, this is a little tower. Let me show you this little tower. This is how I uh, store my paper clips. I don't have that many paper clips. I don't know. I don't have um, that much of them. So this was the second floor. And in the second floor, I have those two boxes. And this is what I was using before. But of course, later on, I'm going to change them to more of those uh, containers. And um, this is the third floor. And in the third floor, I have my collection of notebooks that um, I had gotten. You know, I target different ones. 
and of in, including these little ones that I altered. These are the ones that you get in Michael's uh, three for a dollar. I uh, altered them. I used them for my checkbook. And in the sorry about that. That is dark in here. It's kind of late at night. And in this one, I have a to go package uh, po uh, that I use. You know when I, I'm planning on the go. And some other bags that I can use. And um, my planner cover is also in there. And I have some crayons or other items. And in the back, I put uh, a big clear container. And the big clear container um, is going to be for when um, I have leftover stickers. Like you cut a piece and then you put, um, you have leftovers. So I'm just going to put that box in the back. So this was my organization uh, box. I mean, my organization in my IKEA Rascal card for planners. And I posted this on Instagram and uh, uh, people like this. I wanted to share it with you guys and tell you that um, I haven't been making videos for the past month. I kind of took a break. I was, I've been cleaning my craft room. I feel kind of overwhelmed. It was messy. So uh, thanks to my daughters, I've been, um, you know, throwing stuff out that I didn't need it and cleaning it. And I fell in there like it, I was a little bit um, not inspired anymore. So now that it's clean, I'm going to be able to start uh, working on new projects and sharing with new stuff with you guys. Thank you so much for watching and commenting on my videos. Have a great afternoon, you too. Hope you guys like my new IKEA Rascal card. Thank you for watching.